welcome plans to our spiritual house cleansing and blessing ministration. For better results, we suggest you play this prayer repeatedly throughout the day on a regular basis, even while you sleep at night. Let's get started now. Heavenly Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we just come before your holy throne and we ask that you forgive us of all sins we have committed against you and against those made in your image. Lord, we also ask right now, according to your word, Psalm 34, verse 7, which says, The angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear him and he delivers them. We ask right now that you camp your angels around every person living in this home. We also ask that you camp your angels in every room in this home to protect this family against any form of retaliation of the devil and his demons. And we declare Isaiah 54, 17, No weapon formed against them shall prosper. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, according to Luke chapter 10, verse 19, which says, I have given you authority to trample on the snakes and the scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy and nothing will harm you. We now renounce all opportunities for ground held by Satan and his demons in relation to this home and property. According to Matthew 16:19, which says, Whatever you bind on earth is bound in heaven, and whatever you lose on earth is loosed in heaven. We now bind with chains and fetters of iron all wicked spirits, their schemes and assignments against this home, property, and the people who live here. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now evict Satan and his demons from this home and property with any controlling powers of darkness. We send you evil spirits to where you may never haunt, control, or harm any person any longer. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now renounce all past use of this property and home for false religions, occult practices, divination, magic, sorcery, witchcraft, spiritualistic healings, and such. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now remove all curses, spells, hexes, vexes, witchcraft spells, voodoo spells, satanic spells, and all occult evil. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now renounce all expressions of anger, bitterness, rebellion, revenge, hate, and lack of submission to God's will exercised by people who live on this property at the present or who previously lived here. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now remove all anger, bitterness, rebellion, revenge, stubbornness, spirits of hate, murder, homicide, suicide, premature death, accidents, hatred, violence, abuse, domestic violence, separation, child abuse and molestation, fear, and the like, seeking to rule and destroy this home. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now renounce all expressions of pride and control exercised by people who live on this property at the present or who previously lived here. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now remove from this property all prideful and controlling spirits. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now renounce all acts of immorality, sexual impurity, pornography, indecency, strife, jealousy, envy, selfishness, drunkenness, drug abuse exercised by people who live on this property at the present or who previously lived here. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now remove all immoral, indecent, strifeful, jealous, drunkenness, drug abuse, and envious spirits from this home and property. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now renounce all generational claims against this home and property, including ground obtained through worship of false gods, Satanism, practice of sorcery, fortune telling, consulting with psychics and mediums, Freemasons, and other secret societies. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now cast out from this property all demonic spirits associated with these wicked acts. 
Father in heaven, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we now ask you that you expose and reveal to us all accursed objects that must leave this home and property, including clothing, pictures, motion pictures, toys, magazines, souvenirs, music collection, games, jewelry, occult books, and the like that have brought abomination to this home and property, so that we must destroy them. Father in heaven, we now dedicate this home and property to you. We ask that you bless and anoint every room in this home and all corners of this property. We also ask you that you bless everyone living on this property. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen. Welcome, friends, to our intensive spiritual neighborhood cleansing ministration. For better results, we suggest you play this prayer repeatedly throughout the day on a regular basis, even while you're sleeping at night. We also suggest you encourage others in your zip code area to also do likewise. The more households play this prayer, the better. Let's get started now. Heavenly Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, according to Luke chapter 10 verse 19, which says, I have given you authority to trample on the snakes and the scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy and nothing will harm you. We now renounce on behalf of this entire zip code area, all opportunities for ground held by Satan and his demons in relation to this neighborhood. According to Matthew 16, 19, which says, Whatever you bind on earth is bound in heaven, and whatever you loose on earth is loosed in heaven. We now bind and restrain with chains and fetters of iron, all wicked spirits, their schemes and assignments against the zip code jurisdiction, and the people who live here. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now evict you, Satan, and your demons from this neighborhood with any controlling powers of darkness. We send you, evil spirits, to where you may never harm or control anyone any longer. Get out of this neighborhood right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now renounce all present and past use of this neighborhood for false religions, occult practices, divinations, magic, sorcery, witchcraft, spiritualistic healings and search. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now remove all curses, spells, witchcraft spells, voodoo, satanic ritual sacrifices, and all occult evil. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we now renounce all expressions of anger, hate, bitterness, envy, jealousy, rebellion, defiance, and lack of submission to God's will exercised by people who live on the zip code neighborhood or who previously lived here. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now expose and remove all demons behind bitterness, rebellion, revenge, crimes, rape, child abuse and molestation, child pornography, pedophilia, modern day slavery, forced labor, abduction, drug use, drug abuse, and drug dealing, homicide, suicide, domestic violence, drunkenness, family division and separation, school shootings, hate crimes, gangs, corruption, foster care abuse, gang related crimes and violence child prostitution, hatred, satanic ritual abuse, prostitution, violence, vandalism, robbery, terrorism, witchcraft, murder, premature death, abortion, automobile accidents, and the like, seeking to rule and destroy this zip code area. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now renounce all expressions of pride and control exercised by people who live in this neighborhood at the present or who previously lived here. 
in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now remove all demonic pride and control from this neighborhood. Get out of here, evil spirits, now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now renounce all generational claims against this neighborhood, including ground obtained through worship of false gods, blood sacrifices, Satanism, practice of sorcery, fortune telling, psychic consultations, tarot card readings, Freemasons, and other secret societies. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now cast out from this zip code jurisdiction all evil spirits associated with these wicked acts. Father in heaven, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we now ask you that you expose all evil practices that have been done secretly in the zip code area. Father in heaven, we now dedicate the zip code jurisdiction to you. We ask that you anoint and bless every home, street, shopping center in this neighborhood. We also ask that you anoint and bless our school district, our law enforcement and government officials. We also ask you that you bless everyone living in this neighborhood in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen. Hello friends and welcome to our spiritual warfare prayer entitled Exercising Spiritual Authority over our cities, states and nations. It's judgment time. We call the shots. Let's pray for protection first. Father in heaven, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we just come before your holy throne. We ask that you forgive us of all sins we have committed against you and against those made in your image. Father, we ask right now, according to your word in Psalm 34, verse 7, which says the angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear him and he delivers them. Father, we ask right now that you camp your angels around all of us here, uh, participating of this prayer. Also around our loved ones, our family members, ministry partners, in-laws, ex-in-laws, and friends to protect us and keep us safe from any form of retaliation or attacks of the devil and his demons. And we declare Isaiah 54, 17, no weapon formed against us shall prosper. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. The word of the Lord says in 2 Chronicles chapter 7, verse 14, If my people which are called by my name shall humble themselves and pray, and seek my face, and turn from their wicked ways. Then will I hear from heaven, and will forgive their sin, and heal their land. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we now renounce on behalf of this city, state, and nation, all opportunities for ground held by Satan, his demons, and human agents in relation to these legal jurisdictions. According to Luke chapter 8, verse 17, which says, For nothing is secret that will not be revealed, nor anything hidden that will not be known and come to light. We now expose and declare judgment over all Satan's wicked spirits, their schemes and assignments, and all evil works carried on by Satan's human agents over the city, state, a nation. The word says, do you not know that the saints, God's people, will judge the world? And if the world will be judged by you, are you unworthy to judge the smallest matters? Do you not know that we shall judge angels? How much more things that pertain to this life? 1 Corinthians chapter 6 verses 2 and 3. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth and by the power of his shed blood on the cross, we now command to come to light all Satan's evil actions carried on by his demons and human agents in the city, state, and nation. We also put a limit to these actions. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we now revoke all controlling powers of darkness over all governing authorities ruling over the city, state, and nation. 
We now bring to judgment all secret satanic agenda, corruption and wickedness in high places being exercised over these jurisdictions in the name of money, sex, control, and power. We also expose and bring to judgment all secret works of darkness done by satanic entities and organizations with the purpose of expanding the territories of the kingdom of Satan in the city, state, and nation and negatively influence the, and brainwash the minds of vulnerable people, bringing destruction upon this city, state, and nation. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, we now bring to judgment all demonic strongholds established throughout this city, state, and nation with the purpose of expelling righteousness, godly, and moral principles from our schools and introducing wickedness to our children and young adults. Satan, all your evil works over the city, state, and nation, and also over the airwaves, is now being judged by our living God, creator of heaven and earth. We now demand that all corruption and wickedness in high places over the city, state, and nation be now exposed and brought to light and to judgment by the courts of heaven, where our righteous judge presides. We now command confusion to enter the enemy's camp, causing major chaos among Satan's demons and evil human agents. Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, let your will be done this day on earth as it is in heaven. Father, Surround this city, state, and nation with your mighty army of warrior angels with the purpose of removing all unrighteousness from these legal jurisdictions. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. All right, believers, make sure you play this prayer repeatedly throughout the day, okay? And, uh, and we believe that you're going to start noticing, you know, positive changes happening in your neighborhood, city, state, and nation. Amen. Make sure you watch the news to see what is that that is being brought to light by our living God in heaven. Amen. God bless you now and have a good day. Bye-bye. All right, folks. How many of you know that the devil is closing in? How many of you know that we are on the verge of a nuclear war, which if it happens, is going to be the end of everything? Right? Well, can we do something about it? Can we do what God wants us to do? So God's plan can come to play? Instead of man's plan, God's plan. So I'd like to encourage those of you to, that would like to participate and make a difference in your neighborhood, in your home, and in your city. And you can become a city conqueror for Christ. It doesn't matter where you live. It doesn't matter what country. You can become a city conqueror right there in your city. And you should, amen, to make a difference in your home, in your neighborhood, and in your city, and obviously in your family. Amen. Praise God. That's it.